Good afternoon and welcome back to Farkless. Today we take on Red Bull Salzburg at home in Norwich City's first ever game in the Champions League. Champions League has not been kind to us, I'll show you in a second. And then we head to the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium to take on Spurs in the Premier League. And they should really rename that ground to something proper. You can't call it that. That's like generic name you get on Football Manager when it doesn't give you a... Unless it gives it to a previous player or manager. Just the whatever... The Norwich City Stadium, that's what's going to come. If we go that far into it, that's what a new ground will be called, unless you fiddle with it. Anyway, a couple of bits of housekeeping. I do have the unspecified virus of unspecified origin. You have to say that on YouTube, otherwise you get demonetized. Uh, I've been in bed since Tuesday night. I I'm just out of bed now today at 12 o'clock on Friday, and I want to go back to bed. So if we get through this video, uh, it's a miracle, let's be honest. We've got a brand new camera. 4K camera, it is absolutely superb. The green screen is gone for the time being because I'm renovating this room because it's Ben's bedroom soon. Uh, and it's just kind of in the way at the moment. So there's things going on in the background. You can't see, but if I move the chair, you just see like all sorts of planks of wood and things where I'm building this bed and stuff, which has been delayed a little bit again because I'm pretty ill. I am recording the video and the webcam separately. So it goes out of sync a bit. I'm sorry, it's the first time I tried it. I'm trying my best, okay? Mock me down below in the comments. But, since you were last week, things have gone really, really well. We are second in the league, behind United, and the game after the Chelsea game, we beat Brentford away from home, comfortably 2-0. Uh, their ground is weird. they got a weird ground, but Lucas Sukic got both goals. We're 2-0 up after 30 minutes. I thought, you know what, we'll go out and batter these. However, we did go out and batter Stoke. Stoke are a weird one. Stoke had come up into the Premier League and they offered me money for John Sargent and I went, yes, yes, take him off me. Josh Sargent, John Sargent, a newsreader. However, he wouldn't go and I thought, why won't you go? Well, that is why. We beat them 5-0. Okay, we scored in the 82nd and 87 minutes and Umtiti got two. Rodrigo scoring goals. Max Aaron, okay, the, the goals are a bit in a bit weird place. And then we beat Fulham 4-2 and this was difficult. Fulham went 1-0 up. We were then 4-1 up and they pulled the goal back and made it a bit squeaky bomb time at the end but other than that, Fairly straightforward. And it leaves things looking a little bit like this. We're second in the league. We have got joint points with United. We're a point clear Liverpool. I don't expect us to stay here. If you look at the teams we played, we've already played Chelsea, who are decent, and we drew with them. So, listen, when we play all the good teams, we'll see that against Spurs, really. Spurs are a decent team. We're going to lose, let's be honest. And the Champions League has not been kind to us, which I didn't think it would. we got, where are we? So I'll go back there. PSG, Dortmund, and Red Bull. Red Bull are the weakest team in the group. Uh, I suppose, fingers crossed, we get into the Europa League. So, we're going to take on Red Bull first here. And, and we're going to hope for the best. We're going to line up like this. Pickford, Wyndall, Titi, Mina, Ahrens, Marita, Benton, Kors, Sukic, Matika, Rodrigo and Thomas. Nothing happened in the transfer window at the very end, the deadline day. So, I can't show you much of that. No, no real players of note went out. No real players of note came in. We really struggled with the registration. For for the Champions League, it was really hard. I've annoyed so many players. And we have stolen their three best players in the last year or so. So we've got to beat them, haven't we? They line up like this. Cone, Gomez, Piet... I'm going to struggle with this. Piet Tatowski, Oka, Gyundo, Capaldo, Kamara, Bernardi. Not even attempting that. Uh, Karam Is that Karamanko? Karamoko? I can say that. And Kota... Can any of the Scandinavians, I'm looking at you, um, Sass. Tell me how to pronounce that. That's a Kiergaard. Is it Kiergaard? I'm, I'm just going to say that. They're managed by Jelise. No, no, who he is. No idea. Uh, we're famous for reason. Go up there and let's win. We get a win here. It puts us a long way towards getting through to that Europa League place. Do you go into the Conference League if you finish fourth? I suppose it's the only consolation. Anyway, Rodrigo to Aaron's to Marita. It's poor. Their kit looks horrendous. They bring it forward. What is going on with those shorts? Diarrhea yellow shorts. Minas give the ball away to Karamoko and they've scored. And uh, that's not how you want to start a Champions League game. Your first ever Champions League campaign. And after a minute, you give them a ball to go one-on-one. -on -one. What is he doing here? Perfect control. Just give it to the goalkeeper. Why play that ball? Okay, I'm going to sound a little more frustrated than normal because, honestly, I am massively struggling to breathe for one of the things. But that is really, really frustrating. And 
Yeri Mina, who's having an absolute stellar career at Norwich, is poor there. Wyndell puts the ball in, we've headed one over. He should be aiming for the front post as well with that. We told him a million times, aim for that front post, and he's not done it. Ah, right. We've got more attacking. Do we go a little bit more direct? I don't know. Uh, we're only 21 minutes in. I don't want to change too much now. Maybe demand a bit more. But as it stands, we're bottom of our group. With the easiest game first. So, no idea what PSG and Borussia Dortmund are going to do to us. Absolutely murderous. Anyway, Wyndell, Matika. Can he get a good ball in? He does get a ball in to Sukic. Not great. Back to Aaron's. Aaron's shot. It's blocked. Keeper just dives out the way. Aaron's ball back in. Oh, there we go. Thiago Thomas, our first goal in the Champions League. One of hopefully many. Uh, somebody did ask, would we carry this on when the tier 10 database comes out? We will carry on until Norwich win the Champions League, I think. And I'll try and do two series at once. However, it might be alternate days because I don't think I can do both. Uh, we'll, we'll see anyway. We'll see. But there we go. Thiago Thomas. Very simple finish. Aaron's making the goal again. He's just superb down that flank. He's down as a fullback. He plays more as a wing back. Gomez, ball into the box. I do not concede from this. I think we'll give away a penalty. No? Okay, I have no idea what happened there. Did we get a free kick? Karamoko. Gomez. Kamara. Gomez. They are tearing us up, aren't they? Do not give a penalty away. I don't mind them fouling. I'm just fouling outside the area. We've blocked one. Gindo. Bernard. Kier God. I'm trying. I am trying with that one. We've headed it clear. Sukic has got it. Gives it to Aaron's. Aaron's. Ball over top. It's not great from Aaron's. Not what you expect from Aaron's. Aaron's is usually better than that. He uses the ball much better. They play the ball as a chance. Do not do it again, Mina. He gives it to Pickford this time. Mtiti to Marita. Out to Wyndall. And here we go. This is much better. Wyndall's still going. He puts the ball towards Thomas. It's poor. The highlight. If the highlight whole thing was that header, I'm questioning what. SI think key highlights are. And there you go. 1-1 one, one a half time. I'm not impressed. We are much the better team. But I'm not impressed with that. I'm going to say I'm far from pleased I've seen from this team. We've got to be winning this game. If we want to go anywhere in the Champions League or do anything, we have to win this game. And Victor Gomez has got a corner. It's into the box and they've headed it over. Um, after saying that to him a half time, the, the last thing you want is them to nearly score. Wydal. He's in a bit of a pickle here. He gives it to Umtiti. Umtiti's a Pickford. Pickford. Out wide, it's headed back, but it's picked up by Aaron's. Aaron's again. How is your right back, your major playmaker? Ball in towards Thiago Thomas, who was offside. Ball's cleared away. Who's playing badly? Umtiti's having a bad game, even though it wasn't his fault for the goal. Why was Jerry Mina on a 7.0? He basically give a goal away. Coiter, Gindo, Mina, Aaron's. Here we go again. Aaron's got the ball. Back to Marita. Marita into Thiago Thomas. Rodrigo's picked it up. He's out wide. We need to get players in the box here. Come on, boys. Sukic. Back to Rodrigo. Square. He does to Thomas. And there we go. 2-1 in a Champions League game. Fantastic stuff. Uh, you may notice I've got two yellow football tops in the background. They aren't Norwich tops, believe me. They are Tramia tops. Uh, my head's in the way of one. A bit. But yeah. Uh, Rodrigo pulls it back. Not Knocked in by Thomas. And there we go. 2-1 up. I hope it stays that way. I've dropped us down to positive anyway. What are we checking for offside here for? There's, there's nowhere anywhere near offside. I mean, even the lines are wrong. Why are the lines wrong? <laughs> anyway, if we get another goal here, that'd be fantastic. And I think we, we sh we're a mo much better team than Salzburg, let's be honest. A team that finishes fourth in the Premier League should absolutely batter a team from Austria. I'm sorry, Austrians. Wyndell, ball in. It's cleared away. It's picked up again by Wyndell. Into Benton Court. Benton back to Untiti. Untiti to Mina. Mina to Sukic. Sukic. Thiago Thomas. Back to Thomas. And look at that. It's beautiful. Was that his hat trick on his Premier League debut? Is it? It is. A hat trick on a Premier League. Premier League. I'm talking rubbish. His Champions League debut for Thiago Thomas. There you go. He's already halfway to winning the Golden Boot in the Champions League. Well, beautiful bit of play between him and Rodrigo. And it's 3 1. And who's playing badly? Benton Court could be playing better. T you know what? Now we're 3 1 up. I'm taking on TT off. I'm going to bring on Collins, who's going to be a better player. And I'm going to bring off Bensacourt and bring on where's he gone? 
Mangala. Come on, Mangala. Go out there and Mangala things. Marita. Rodrigo. Plays a ball through, but nobody's there. I don't think it was Rodrigo, was it? Who is it? Was the highlight that ball? It was a highlight to me that that was an awful ball. Is that what it was doing? Anyway. We've got a free kick on the edge of the box. Ball's to the back post. Rodrigo's there. And should... Was it Mangler or Thomas that had that header? Should he have had a fourth if it was Thomas? I think so. Gomez. We've only got ten minutes to go. Do not concede now. Kjargaard is in and he's put it wide. You know when he dinked it kind of over the keeper there? I thought it's a goal. But Kjargaard, if that is how you pronounce it, has an absolute shocker. An absolute shocker. If you notice the lighting looks much, much better on this camera. It really does. I need to move over a little bit, I think. But I'm, I'm impressed with this. I'd like to thank Scoops Callahan for the recommendation. Uh, it does make him look like a fat Brad Pitt. Anyway. <laughs> here we go. A 3-1 win. You won't watch this. You won't get that far into this game. A 3-1 win into the <laughs> game's Red Bull Salzburg. On our Champions League debut is pretty good. I'm pleased with that. Well done, lads. Good win for us. And um, you know what? As debuts goes, could have gone any better, really, could it? Okay, we, we can see it after a minute. Coromoco after a minute there. Rangers beat AC Milan. Go home, football manager. You're drunk. Anyway, going to click on now for the Spurs game. And I'll see you in a second. Welcome back then for the Spurs game. Exactly the same team. I don't see any point in changing it. I do think this will be our first defeat, though. Pickford, Wijnaldum, Umtiti, Mina, Ahrens, Marita, Bentancourt, Sukic, Matika, Rodrigo and Thomas. Again, this is our first real challenge other than Chelsea. We drew a home with Chelsea. They're going to be good. Let's be honest. They're... And there we go. They line up like this. Roberto Mancini is now the Spurs manager. Bizarre. How do you say that? Now? Bigelow, Royal, Verissimo, Rod Rodon, Balde, Lo Celso, and Dombele, Ali, Bergwijn, Son and Zapata. Where has all their players gone? This looks like a bizarre team. Bernadeschi is on the bench run. So is Davison Sanchez. Harvey Weiss, Oli, Skip, Hoiberg, Loris. Where did Harry Kane go? Where on earth is Carmen San Decano? I won't do that ever again. Don't worry. Anyway, I am struggling a lot now. So I <laughs> hope you can't tell. Oh, Spurs. Let's get in here. Let's do our best to grind out a result. Where are Spurs? Tenth in the league. Five games, five points. Including this one. So they've only won one and drew one. Uh, maybe. Maybe we might do okay. Emerson Royal's got it though. He brings it forward. He punts it forward. Bentoncourt, Sukic, tried to play in Rodrigo, but not quite. It was a good ball, other than it was cut out. I think it's the best way you can put it. But that name looks a lot like an anagram of, of something else. Uh, Dali Ali's got it. Is he any good anymore? Probably not. <laughs> Why is he playing? Still playing for Spurs. Balde, Ali. But, oh, what a save from... Is it a good save from Pickford? He was diving the wrong way and saved it. But is it a bad save because he shouldn't have dived in the wrong way? Oh, who knows? He didn't cover himself in glory the other night against Liverpool, did he? Emerson Royal, and that's a highlight over. Leeds are beating United, so a win here would put us top. Because currently Liverpool are top as they're beating Wolves 1-0. But if we can get a positive result... I'd say a draw is a decent result, to be honest. Wind out with a corner to Yerry Mina. How's he missing that? Yerry Mina six yards out. He's nine foot two and he's missing headers. I'm not impressed, Mr. Mina. Mr. Mina. That's a good pull in there, isn't it? There's a good pull. Maybe it was a Mr. Mina. And it, oh, well, just ignore me. Just ignore me. I'm delirious. I've got a fever. Royal. Can we get the ball off him? Verissimo. Roden. Out wide. To Balde. Son, who is their best player by a country mile. We need to keep him quiet. Balde's tackled, but he rides a challenge, puts a ball into the box. And uh, Duvan Zapata, who I know very little of, has fired one into the top corner. And like I said, I did think this would be our first defeat of the season. Uh, Balde, I mean, you've got to question Rodrigo to poor tackle. But that's a good finish. And I'm not entirely sure what Jordan Pickford is attempting there. He may as well just sat down. It would have looked a lot better than what he did there. Verissimo. Bergwijn. Verissimo. Out to Emerson Royal. 
He's just outside the box. He puts a cross in. Picked up by Zapata. Back to Boldy. Boldy. Ball into the box to Bergwijn. He's put it right across the box. I think it was a shot. But thankfully didn't get knocked in. We do have Wijnald. Big long throw in. And uh, yeah, that's how you score big long throw ins. What are we checking here? You can't be offside from a throw in. So what are we checking? Checking the goal review. Goal award. Of course it's awarded. It was a throw in. What we, what we decide is offside here. Well, I don't know what they thought was offside in that. But we've equalised from Rodrigo. And yeah, I know long throws and near post corners are a bit overpowered, but that's not my fault. They're in the game, dressing room wise. Uh, go out there and give the fans the money's worth. Like, you know what? I've been a bit harsh there. A one all draw away at Spurs is not the end of the world. It's a decent draw. Uh, Sukic has taken a big kick, so we're going to get Sukic off. For, oh Jesus. Almeida can be a. He could come on and be a Mazzola, couldn't he? Yeah, let Almeida do that. He needs some game time anyway. Sukic is a big loss because he is one of our best players. A lot goes through him. Verissimo and Dombele. Verissimo, La Celso. Verissimo again and Dombele. Verissimo. These one make me say these names, don't they? All the way back to BJ. Rodon. Ball out wide to Son. Now, can we kick him? This is where you kick him. Right there. Don't let him do that. So Pata, I was going to say a score, but he fires at just miles wide. Absolutely miles wide. And we're still in the game. Thiago Thomas isn't having the best of games, so we will get him off. Because we do have a goal striker here in Sesco. Sesco for me are more advanced. Everyone else is doing okay. Maurice is okay. Um TT again not having a great game. <coughs> Apologies. I did say that was gonna happen. Sesco's on the pitch. Big, big lag, Sesco, 195 centimetres. I need to change it back to feet so I know how tall he is, don't I, really? Our wingers are playing well. Son. With a free kick. And as I say, if that goes in, I'd have been well annoyed. Because nobody marked whoever that was in the box whatsoever. Well, here we go. It's all spares now. It was all us at one point. Royal. Verissimo. Lo Celso. Ali. Out wide to Son. And a lot's going through Son now. Son. Good ball to the box. Zapata's there. He's headed over. Now, Zapata could have easily had four goals in this game. Easily. But... All on his first finish, he's been pretty poor. Uh, Marita's knackered. We're going to get, you know what? He's been kicked. Mangler on for Marita, and we'll swap him and Benzenko around because Benzenko does that a little bit better, I think. Aaron's has got it. Plays it back to Yeri Mina. Yeri Mina saunters forward. Almeida towards Sesco. And I, I'm not entirely sure what this highlight's all about. It's about an offside decision. Yeah. Sometimes offside decisions are uh, highlight worthy. Emerson Royale. Good tackle by Mangler. Just on the pitch to do that. Wyndell. Ball through to Sesco. Can Sesco score? He can't. He did everything right. Even opened his body up to finish like that. But it's a poor, poor finish. But you know what? I'm taking I'm taking a one-all draw away at Spurs. I think that's pretty good. Uh, you're all lucky today. We should have won it in the end there. That Sesco should have finished that. He's a big lad. He's quick. Uh, he's only young though. Let's give him. Let's give him a break. We haven't lost the game this season. I can't complain, can I? Really, can't really complain. So anyway, Sukic is injured. He's out for two weeks. Painful, painful. Mancini wants VAR answers. Once again, VAR correct. We have seen VAR correct a referee in decision. I'm still looking for clear. What? It was a long throw. You cannot be offside from throwing. Are you drunk, Mancini? Anyway, Marita's now up here. Oh. Jesus, half the team's out injured, and that, that's going to be difficult for the Champions League. We are eight matches unbeaten. At least the table looking a little bit like this. We are second in the league. With a win there, we would have been top. But Liverpool beat Wolves 1-0. Interestingly, they've lost the We haven't lost the game. Neither have City or Arsenal. Everyone else has. It was a good start to the season. Four wins, two draws. 17 goals for, six against is the worry. It's a lot against Liverpool. One conceded one goal uh, and lost one nil. Obviously, <laughs> bizarre. Champions League wise, doesn't really matter. We're top of our group because PSG and Borussia Dortmund score, and when we um, score, draw, drew, drawn, drew. I can't. You know what? I am getting pretty tired. 
I need to lie down. Anyway, we'll be back for the Dortmund game. Dortmund. I'm going to show you Dortmund Leicester. Because Dortmund City, I think I'll lose the will to live. I was losing 6 0 both games. So I'm going to come back for Dortmund Leicester. I am due back tomorrow night on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash echoes at 7 pm. We're going to play it by ear though because this has been a bit of a struggle. I'm hoping I feel a lot better tomorrow and I, I won't be. We'll, we'll see from tomorrow's video. I'll let you know. But it, listen, guys, I really appreciate all the support. Support on this and on Twitch has been absolutely immense. So thanks very much. If you really want to support the channel, don't worry about donations or Patreons or all that stuff. Just leave a comment down below. A like on on the video. I, I, I forgot how to do an outro. <laughs> Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And I'll see you all again tomorrow. And I, I, I apologise if the camera's out of sync to the talking. See you later.